Hey guys, it's Ray from Diamond and uh, I got my uh, friend Ross with me today who's a master carpenter. We're going to check out his uh, his work van. It's a traveling shop. Uh, but I got to got to ask you Ross, what's what's the champion tag for in the front of the vehicle? Oh, that's uh, that's very very special to us our family. It's uh, our youngest son Aiden won the uh, MLS Cup championship with the uh, Columbus crew. Wow, sweet. So, sweet. He gave me that for a Christmas present, actually. Yeah, that was uh, <laughs> the 2020. 2020 MLS Cup final. Yeah, sweet, sweet. Champions. Sweet. So, listen, tell me uh, about your van. What is this? Uh, what kind of van is this? And what year this is, is it? It's a Mercedes Sprinter van, 2500. It's a 2018. Mm -hmm. And throughout my construction carpentry career, I've always owned vans and I've always sort of customized them to suit my uh, trades and skills and stuff like that. Basically, it's a shop on wheels and I carry most of my tools on board. So I pull up to a job site and whatever I need, I, I pull out and, and uh, how grab many... as I need. Yeah, so... Uh, you got a side door to this uh, yeah. van? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's, that's a view from the back initially. Yeah. I can kind of explain a little bit what's yeah. going on if needed. And the side door. Nice. Here I got um, nice. Kind of a, a little bit in the sloppy mode at the moment, but um, I have these custom drawers and stuff that I made with a custom uh, latch system that. Uh, oh wow, that's really cool. Doesn't uh, allow it to open up when we're swaying back and forth down the road. Yeah, and and then uh, all this cabin, cabin, ca all these cabinets here and storage, uh, you built in place. Yep, mm -hmm. built them in place. Put half inch plywood on the walls first, and then put all the gable ends and uh, just to house all the various uh, tools that I have. And it's kind of sometimes a constant evolution because I rethink things and tweak it or you get some new tools and you got to redo it. It's interesting how you uh, secure everything. Um, uh, how do you stop everything from moving? What, what have you done here? Maybe with some of, the uh, some of the bins or areas I use um, like just a little lip on the edge. That's all that's needed and other areas. Oh, I um, see. Like here. Yeah. Yeah. Other areas I'll have like... Um, just a sloping shelf on it so that it uh, like for instance this were all my nail guns this is my nail gun department you know I have grinder and sanding, yeah um, up nice. above but this one here where the nail guns are is all it's a slope shelf yeah and uh, it doesn't allow them to you know slide out slide out really nice and back there is a custom fasteners all my screws and fasteners yeah yeah and stuff, yeah sweet everything slides out and you know that doesn't come out i haven't had a failure with that at all yet it stays there no matter oh how man that is moves. beautiful and then this 